All right, this is how to get Epic Games or basically any other third-party games onto your Steam Deck, and it's in two easy steps. Number one is you're gonna install a program that'll do everything for us, and this is called the non-Steam Launcher. And then number two, you're going to install games via that non-Steam Launcher, and that's it. Those are both of the steps. Let's go get our non-Steam Launcher, and what you're going to wanna do is go to a web browser, go to Google, and you can type in non-Steam Launcher's GitHub, and that's going to take you to its GitHub, where we can then download the file and you can go to this green button here, hit the drop down arrow and hit download zip. It doesn't really matter where you save the zip, the downloads folder is going to work great. Then once the file is downloaded, what you're going to do is go into your downloads folder and then extract it. And I would recommend extracting it onto the desktop because that's gonna make the file easy to locate once it's done. Now we can see a folder called non-steam launchers on the desktop and we're going to open that folder and then open non-steam launchers.sh. Once we open that, you're gonna get a list of launchers and you can check out all the launchers that you want to install right here. I'm gonna install Epic and GOG for the video, but pick whatever ones you want and then hit okay. It's gonna ask after for a custom website and you can just ignore that and hit okay. Then it's gonna go out and download the launchers. So this might take a second depending on how fast your Wi-Fi is. Then after the downloads are done, the program will close itself. Then you can open Steam and you're going to see the launchers that you chose showing up as Steam games in your library. Go ahead and hit play on the launcher. We're gonna use Epic in this case. And then you'll have to log into your Epic account. Once you've logged in, you can view your games. I'm gonna get Rocket League. And you can just hit install and the game will download, then install. Again, this could take a while if it's a big game, so just chill for a sec. Once the game is downloaded and installed, you can close out of Steam and switch back into the gaming mode via this icon on the desktop. Now the non-Steam launchers are going to show up as games in our gaming mode. So you can just scroll through your games and hit play on the launcher that you want and it is as easy as that. Now you just hit open, you can pick the game that you wanna play from the launcher and now you're playing, that's it. If you appreciated this guide, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to see more videos like it. All right, see ya.